Hello folks, so today it is 2020, May, June, paper 1-1, one, one, and the question number is 9. <clears throat> it says that it is concerned with the chapter uh, forces, let us say, I can say forces or even uh, uh, kinematics also, <laughs> because we are ta talking about opposing forces here, uh, and its relationship on, its uh, effect on the velocity or the, or the accelerations. So it says, uh, the resultant force F on a raindrop of mass M falling with velocity v is given by the equation something like this so we have a raindrop a raindrop falling with a certain velocity and the force on it is mainly force of gravity and the opposing force is kv square it is concerned with the drag force actually <coughs> kv square uh, so the resultant is the fg minus uh, kv square where k is a constant and g is the acceleration of free fall yes it's okay what is the velocity of the raindrop when it reaches a constant velocity? So we have to find the velocity v of the raindrop when, when, when we have constant or terminal velocity. So when it attains a terminal velocity, what we have is f is equal to zero because at this time a equal to zero. So a equal to zero means that the resultant force on the body should be equal to zero because that is what is said by uh, the second law of motion second law of motion the resultant force is equal to mass into a at a terminal velocity or constant velocity a equal to zero so f equal to zero so i can say because because a equal to zero so this means that we have f equal to mg mg minus kv square is also equal to zero so this gives us this gives us mg is equal to kv square uh, which gives us v square is equal to v squared is equal to so this is not uh, writing is equal to mg by k and gives us v is equal to root mg divided this k so it might look a bit odd but the question is uh, answer is very simple so v equal to root of mg by k and they're going through the choices choice number c is the correct choice